I think we should get out. We're Kyle and Natty, and we're traveling on just $60 a day as a couple. If you haven't watched our last video, we rode an extremely chaotic bus in Sri Lanka for 10 hours to get to Arugam Bay. In today's video, the craziness of Sri Lanka continues, and we ended up having one of the scariest moments of our lives, being chased by a wild elephant. Good morning from the beautiful Arugam Bay, Sri Lanka. Today we're going to show you a day in our life here. Not every day is the same, but we're going to show you what we're doing today. The last time you saw us was like three days ago when we took that crazy bus ride here from Colombo. And this, I guess being in Arugan Bay is kind of like a chill time for us. We're not filming a lot. This will probably be our only video we make here, but it's kind of like a chill work time for us here. Yep, it's been super relaxing, but I guess. We're gonna head to breakfast, so let's go. So yesterday we actually found this little like restaurant on the beach and they had smoothie bowls and coffee and cappuccinos and stuff. So we decided to try them. We've been going to one place for the past few mornings, but we decided to change it up a little bit. Maddie and I both got a smoothie bowl, and they look really big here, so it's not that expensive either. So we're excited. avocado and peanut butter maybe. Looks good. So we are now heading just down the road a little bit to get to a point that's closer to like where all the surfers are right now so we can go watch them. But the craziest thing is that that only cost 3,000 Sri Lankan rupee. Uh, you couldn't get one smoothie bowl for that price in the US. So we absolutely love it and the portion sizes are gigantic too. So it's like really difficult to even finish those. So say that we're loving the food and pricing here in Sri Lanka is an understatement. week in hopes of surfing quite a bit but the waves have not been in our favor for beginners right right now we're actually standing on I think it's called baby point and the waves are, have changed a little bit today it looks like the waves are decent for beginners but yesterday we were trying to surf out at main point and the waves were just huge and we were getting pummeled by them and we figured out the hard way that the bottom of main point is rock and so, yeah both got hurt. So. I think later tonight we're gonna go to, our, to a more beginner spot where it's sandy bottom so we don't get hurt. All right, just finished working. We're pretty tired, but we're gonna go catch some lunch and then head down to surf. So let's, go, let's see what we go and eat. We got a pizza. Yeah, she's my teeth. We got a Viennese pizza, which is just um, cheese with sausages on it. And it's so good. 
Das Pizza was thirteen hundred. Pizza was good. Now we're gonna go home and change. All changed up. And we are heading to a surf point called Elephant Rock. It's about a 10 minute drive from here. Um, and our scooter does not have a surfboard holder on it. So we do have to take a tuk tuk there. Um, but we can't surf at the main point. Yeah. It's a little too rough for us. So we're going to Elephant Rock where it's a little bit more beginner. Hopefully we can get up. Yeah. We'll see. Raja, ahala bongo. Raja, ahala bongo. Raja, ahala bongo. Raja. I think we should get out. Oh my god. Ahala bongo, Raja. My heart is beating out of my chest. An elephant just chased us. Okay, let's go. Do they come on the beach or no? A beach not come. All right, that was really scary. The elephant was literally chasing us, as you can see in my really rough video. And it did its little like blow thing at us. In the ocean or no? Really scary. So as long as you make it to the ocean, you won't go in. Yeah. We made it to Elephant Rock. To surf now. <laughs> so, you're gonna go so let's hope we can get some waves. The um, lagoon is like flowing out into the ocean when usually it's the ocean flowing like into the lagoon. So, um, yeah, I am like freak. I, I do not want to go back over there right now. I am terrified of that elephant. I'm like shaking still. I, that was awful. Yeah, I hope that does not happen to me again. <laughs> the waves here are way more our level. We can just ride the wash and that's really all we need right now. Maddie's going out though right now to try. See if she can get up. I'm so happy that these waves are actually surfable for us. Uh, the other place, like we talked about how big the waves were, but that really wasn't the issue. Like we know that we could have caught waves there, but it was the rock. The rock on the bottom is what we kept hitting and we actually got like pretty hurt. I have a pretty big bruise on my hip. Kyle cut both of his toes open. Like it just was one of those moments where we just didn't feel safe. But here it's completely sand bottom and it's just so much nicer. This is exactly what we wanted to be doing while we were in Arugan Bay. So today, today's good with this surfing just, uh, Still, I'm seriously still running off of like the adrenaline of that elephant chasing us. Like, I don't care if I ever see an elephant again. Like, I never want to see one again. That was terrifying. I awful, awful. But we're gonna try to move past it because we do have to drive back through the exact same spot as that happened. So, gonna see how brave I am. Well, I was actually able to get up on a couple, and now the sun's coming out. Maddie missed me get up on my best wave yet, but now she's heading out again. I'm tired. A lot harder than it looks. Well, Kyle just got back in from surfing, and we are going to head back around this rock to head back to our place to hopefully not see the elephant again 
and to go back to our place. Uh, we, this rock is super hard to maneuver, so we'll see you when we're like on the other side of it. Everyone's going there. Peanut farm. Go, 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 go. <laughs> Far away. Not go, far go, enough. Go, 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 go. Yeah. The elephant chase. <laughs> the elephant chased us again. Fuck oh. That, dude. <laughs> oh my god. Even our chick two driver is like he's scared. The elephant chased us again coming back out. That's our, that's our last time coming to Elephant Rock right now. You said since it's slow season, not as many people come back here and the elephants get really territorial. I tell you, this guy may be going to Elephant Rock. This time no problem. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, this All right, after that, Maddie and I are getting a drink tonight. Like, scariest day of my life. Our adrenaline is still running. Like, I'm speechless. Like, I was silent the entire way back because I don't even know what to say. Like, I don't know if I've ever been that scared. We thought our bus ride was scary at times. <laughs> that was terrible. Even our tuk tuk driver said he's not going back to El Ron. All right, we're gonna go home, get changed, and then bring you out to dinner. Yeah. <laughs> All right, we'll we'll see you when we come back out for dinner. <laughs> All right, just got back downtown to go eat dinner, and we are going to a place called Pello Burger. It's their last day being open, and they have pretty good reviews, so. And it's their last day being open because a lot of these shops and restaurants close um, when the tourist season is done, and they all move down south, so yep. um, it's kind of like the transition period here right now. So this is, yeah, like the last week you should, could really come to Oregon Bay, Right. and after this it's dead. Right. So we got some bruschetta for free because it is their last night open. Uh, so we get to try that, which is nice. Oh, I see you. Whoa, that is so good. <laughs> There's like a whole layer of like um, spices, like underneath. It's like